Hello, and welcome to Legends Of. Today, we are looking at a legend of Ohio, the legend of Mary Stockham. Mary Stockham was a mother of nine children. One of Mary's children was mentally disabled, and her second husband, not wanting to care for a mentally disabled child, killed the young girl. Now, when the town found out, they were pissed. And they hung her second husband. Now, one would think that Mary would be relieved that the man who killed her daughter was dead. But not Mary. In fact, she vowed revenge on the townspeople for killing her husband. It was already rumored that Mary had been into witchcraft. And shortly after the death of her husband, her children began to fall ill and one after one died. After the fifth child died, the townspeople discovered that she had been poisoning her own children. Mary was accused of witchcraft and supposedly burned at the stake. Despite her death, a sixth child got sick and died. The townspeople, still expecting witchcraft, dug up Mary and cut off her head burying it away from the body. After this, it is reported that no more kids got sick, and one kid that was already sick got better. However, this is just the first part of the legend. You see, it is said today that if you visit the cemetery Mary was buried in late at night, you'll see Mary walking the cemetery, looking for her head, attempting to bring it back to her body and to restore her witchy powers. Many have reported seeing her ghost walking the cemetery, and there is even one account of Mary's ghost trying to get a teen girl to follow her into the woods late at night. Would you be brave enough to walk the cemetery at night, or are you scared you may run into the witchy ghost of Mary Stockham?